Tomorrow night, four members of the Chicago Symphony Orchestra's back row charge forward. Normally, these veteran musicians are the pulse beneath the melody. Big and strong and powerful and unrelenting. You know, we're basically the engine room. But in performing the world premiere of this low brass concerto, principal tuba Gene Pocorny, bass trombone Charles Vernon, principal trombone Jay Friedman, and trombone Michael Mulcahy take on a role they rarely know within the orchestra, soloists. For this piece, they play diverse stretches of music from blaring to soothing. We actually can play lyrically. We can actually be below the radar a lot of times. The group met with composer Jennifer Higdon to discuss what they'd want in a piece. The finished product stretches the low brass's range, shifting gears throughout one piece to show off all that these horns can offer. Chicago Symphony Orchestra commissioned the piece with the Philadelphia Orchestra and Baltimore Symphony Orchestra co-commissioning the work from Higdon, who is both a Pulitzer Prize and Grammy winner. While the music flexes several low brass muscles, it finishes with what may be their signature style. Take no prisoners, just, you know, <laughs> yeah. just the take them out, make, make the whole audience flinch. The Low Brass Concerto makes its world premiere right here at Symphony Center tomorrow night. It's only being played three times, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. So you'll have to hurry in if you want to hear it before it leaves town. From Symphony Center, Jesse Kirsch, ABC7 Eyewitness News.